There is a lot of money up for grabs right now, and Orange County is still working to determine who will get a chunk of the millions in tax dollar revenue from our tourism industry. Today, several large organizations like the Orange County Convention Center and Florida Citrus Sports made their case. West Tuesday, Dave McDaniel was at the meeting and joins us live from downtown Orlando. And Dave, the Citizen Advisory Task Force spent hours listening to pitches from those hoping to use those dollars to drive tourism. Well, they did spend hours listening. It started at 1 o'clock and didn't wrap up till about 5 o'clock this afternoon. You know, this is the fourth meeting so far, and there are more meetings that are scheduled as the Citizens Task Force really has the job of looking at the money collected at tourism dollars here in Orange County. That's $300 million plus, $300, $300 million plus over the course of each year. They have to decide how that cash is going to be allocated. Something special is happening in our backyard. Florida Citrus Sports has big plans for Camping World Stadium. How competitive will Orlando be now to host everything in the world that we hope to pursue? It's requesting $800 million to replace the upper bowl with additional seats and a partial roof to make the fans less susceptible to scorching heat and afternoon rains to better compete with other cities for major events where new stadiums have been built. We don't need a $4 billion stadium to win. Right? We just need a venue that can produce the right amount of revenue, have a basic fan experience that allows Orlando to win the day. The Orange County Convention Center was approved for an upgrade pre-COVID, but the project was shelved. They're back, hoping to again get a green light. We're in a great position to start this, this conversation again because we are meeting our mission. We are driving economic impact to the community. We host everything, canoe, kayak, ping pong, you name it. If it's a sport, it's competition, there's an opportunity for us to drive economic impact, bring those entities into our beautiful community. The head of the Greater Orlando Sports Commission, which brought collegiate tennis and the NCAA early brackets to town, is always aggressively looking to lure sports to bring fans to Central Florida. It's bidding years ahead and hopes to get more cash to work with. The home is now known as the Wells Heritage House. And the arts were represented too. Request to expand museum and art opportunities in Central Florida. People interested in cultural tourism tend to stay longer in a, a destination. They also spend uh, more money. And again, there are more meetings on the schedule of this citizen task force. They won't make their recommendation for funding to the Orange County Board of County Commissioners until late July. Reporting live in Orange County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.